Country. and enjoy the happy stream. Ready. Fight. Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This has been a long time, but back to FF7 Rebirth. Day nine, dynamic difficulty. On uh, chapter 10 plus. Aside from that, I have no idea what the hell is going on. Anyway, so... <laughs> yeah, I did, ahead of time, did try the, um... Check the graphic. Uh, just graphic, performance sharp, performance smooth. It's not that great. It's still blurry, in a way, so I'm just keeping it... I'm just keeping it like this for now. I think it's the best weapon. Yeah, it is. Um, let me see what I have. I think Red Thirty had the uh, AP plus. AP up, yeah. Wait, a minute, does he have a two AP up? Oh, oh, Kate Sif have it. Okay. Elemental is almost okay. Let's luck. I would like to. Uh, well, prayer. Oh, prayer is getting close. I'd like to have more than one prayer. Yeah, uh, UFS access and skill for strike. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see if I can get that uh, A rank on this piano music. Just think that I'll be able to, but why not and try? It's just an easy mode. Oh god. Oh god, there's no way in hell I got it. <laughs> oh shit.
No way in hell I got it. Jesus, how much do you need for A? Oh god, I was getting I was close. I'm not just 300 off. Uh is there a uh R1? I'll try one time. Oh, come on, bullshit. Oh god, is that enough? Yes! I got an A! Holy shit! Okay, I'm done. Holy fuck. I'm fine. <sighs> I got save. Can't switch teams. Uh, which one is it? There's probably more children's card game, but I don't think I can access them yet. Here, let's just go on to the. Must well progress. Tonics, liniments, filters. We have everything you need to cure what ails you. Oh shit, just more. Accessories. I don't think they have anything good. Yeah, nothing good. Thank you so much. No matter where you stand, 
can feel the breeze. It's really nice. I was born and raised here, in this canyon. I was to become a Watcher of the Veil like those before me, until I was taken by Shinra. Now that I'm home, and have repaid my debt to you, I plan to serve my village once more. I appreciate all that you've done for me. Thank you. We're really gonna miss you, Red. Oh, don't say that! You're only making this harder! I mean, I wish we had more time, but this is my duty. I suppose it was your duty to act the old man. I wanted you to treat me as an equal, not a dog. Not a pig! Is that you, my boy? Coming! So, was that goodbye? Nah, I'm sure we'll see him around the canyon. The real question is, why'd we come here? To learn the secrets of planetology. Come on! Can't forget that materia! As for me... Ah, that will do. I'm gonna steal some shut-eye, if you don't mind. Then... We can see the sights. The energy coursing through the planet includes those who came before. Learn well the joys of giving. Generosity is a great virtue. interest in Queen's blood. It has bewitched you. Be at ease. It is only natural to hear its call. Queen's blood is of the planet and for the planet. It, like all things, is part of the great cycle that connects us. Indeed, each and every card holds within it a greater purpose, one that belies, therefore. Come, join me in a match that you too may glimpse the truth of our great mother. Yeah, I guess I'll use my suicide deck. It does been a while since I don't remember if I remember how to play it. You can this. That's fine. I don't need this. Wow. Yeah, well, I'd like to use this. Uh, let me see. Bring in Joker. Oh, God, another one? Fuck. Oh, 
Oh shit, can I take over? have one slot left. If he doesn't choose a good card, I win. Okay, I win. Sucking. This. Okay, so let's see, just can pick up this card. Slaughter. A turn I did not expect, which confirms my fears. A strange, wicked pall hangs over the life stream, and a similar dark energy has corrupted Queen's blood. Be careful. The game's pleasures belie the thorns beneath that will bleed you slowly and surely. Many devotees have succumbed to the darkness of which I spoke. Too many. Remember, the cards are a link between us and the planet. If you are in trouble, reach out. She shall answer. Oh, great mother, hear my prayer. Watch over your son. Okay. Alright, damn, this is a much bigger location than I thought. 
Oh, there's another one here. Holy shit. Down there. Tell me, is it better to spread the teachings of planetology to others? So you can see. Trying to eat some grapes. gonna take you home my precious materia where are you no need to be shy come out you fee's gonna take you home oh my god It's our very first catch of the day, folks. We have ourselves a challenger. Hello, sir. Care to tell the folks at home who you are? Ha ha ha. Could this shark be more of a guppy? Well, I spy a row of razor sharp teeth in this little fishy's maw. You might be the QB killer we've been waiting for, but there's only one way to find out. That's right. Our audience doesn't want to hear commentary. They want to see blood. To up the ante, our challenger's opponent will be none other than your host with the most, me, Bernard. Should I put it down right here or should I wait? on the top one. Oh wow. Okay. Uh Wow, dude, he really wants that spot. Holy shit. 
I could do it too. I could play that game. Talk about carnage, am I right? I'm lucky I got out of that match with my limbs intact. Today's shark is a ferocious man-eating menace. He made a serious splash with some ruthless moves. Players the world over have got to be shaken in their boots. Something tells me this beast is about to upset the QB food chain. Better start swimming. Congratulations to you, sir, for an incredible match. Though we found the canyon's resident shark, the fun never ends on this show. Stay tuned because we've got more coming your way. Hey, what does the next session have again? Hmm. Sorrow is not a bird within you all, but let its thoughts. Oh. Fancy running into you here. Say, how about I get a shot of you giving thanks to the planet? The beauty of this place is unreal. Pictures can't do it justice. Wonders such as these have to be experienced in person. I want to believe I can capture this magic. I'm looking for spots with a spiritual feel, if you know any. Seminars 
blessings of the planet upon you. Disciples of her teachings gather here to share their experiences. Through these seminars, we learn from one another and together enrich our lives. Participation in the seminars requires a special invitation from a mentor. Without one, I'm afraid you cannot join. Perhaps you might instead consider taking part in the River of Light ceremony. I suspect you'd enjoy it. A seminar is in progress. All the time I've spent here, listening. Damn, nice draw distance. Ah, not so fast. Sorry, but visitors aren't allowed in here. You see, this is where we keep all our valuables. Really? Valuables, you say? who have the key, as well as fellow Bugenhagen's permission, are allowed inside. If we've anything to fear, it is not our fellow man, nor any creature big or small, with whom we share our home. Oh, these are the friends I was talking about. Thank you for looking after Marmaki. My name is Wolkenhagen. I teach planetology here in the canyon. And one could say I know a thing or two about our world. A thing or two? I doubt there's a thing or two you don't know about it. <laughs> well, it might seem that way to a child like yourself. I'm not a child anymore. I'm 48. Forty what? <laughs> <laughs> Nanaki here has a long life ahead of him. In human terms, I would say he's about 15 or 16 years old. That's more than old enough. I can protect our Vale and everyone in it. Which is more than I can say for my good-for-nothing father. <laughs> Speaking of the members of our little community, have you announced your return to one and all, Mamaki? Not yet. Be right back. Hmm. <laughs> but where are my manners? Please, come in and have a look around. <laughs> Professor Gast to thank. 
that records fluctuations in various energies. I must ask that you handle it with care. It's a rather delicate device, you see. devices are testing the pull of gravity. That's a scale model of our planet and the surrounding stars. One could say the dust it's collected represents the people who live upon it. I never thought you could become even more enchanting. And yet, it's like you're singing to me of the planet's wisdom. Here we seek to gather the wisdom of the planet. While that may appear to be little more than a glistening mineral at a glance, it is, in fact, a crystallized collection of our planet's memories. I never thought you could become even more enchanted. Here we seek to gather the wisdom of the planet. Singing to me of the planet's wisdom. Don't you worry, my dear. I'll find a way to bring out the full depths of your view. <laughs> you recognize that little scamp? I'll have you know that in his childhood, none of it was quite a handful. That is one of the first Marco detectors ever built. Hmm, though I suspect it can't detect much now. <laughs> Let's not be hasty. I'll show you that room later. of a current generator. It harnesses the power of the wind to produce new airflows of its own. Perhaps you've encountered them before during your travels. a larger telescope on the planet. With it, you can see to the edge of the galaxy. There's no better view of the stars than through this scope. <laughs> but the lens could do with some cleaning. My apologies. The lights we observe here have traveled. Mind your manners in front of fellow Bukenhagen. as beautifully complex as the cosmos.
it crying out. A sorrowful dirge indeed. One I've heard all too often of late. This drooping allows us on the surface to hear the inner voice of the planet. What we just heard didn't come from the planet, though. That was definitely the voice of a weapon. Hmm. You seem awfully sure of yourself, miss. Because we saw them, with our own eyes. Two, in the Corel and Gungaga reactors. They were loud and huge. <laughs> A fascinating account, were it true. However, such grand delusions could be a sign of Marco poisoning. Do see a doctor. Um, excuse me? Oh, oh. Yes. That would do them some good. <laughs> Judging from everything you've said, the three of you are unfamiliar with basic planetology. But it is never too late to learn. Please, come with me. Present to you our planetarium. While the Shinra building features the latest iteration, this particular one is my original design. Now then, without further ado. Simply the study of the cosmos and the celestial bodies that dwell in it. Rather, it is a quest to comprehend the cyclical nature of life. Behold, the planet we call home. It was from its soil, so teeming with life, that mankind was born. And like all living things, man is fated to die. So, what happens next? The body withers and returns to the planet. But what of the mind, the spirit, the soul? Much like its former vessel, it too returns whence it came. the great river where all intertwine and circle the planet without end. A cycle of continuous convergence and divergence. The ceaseless ebb and flow that is the life stream. An apt name, though it is as much a reservoir as it is a stream, being the sum of the planet's spiritual energy. It is the very essence of our star. The blood coursing through its planetary veins. And if ever that essence were to be entirely depleted, Of course, 
these are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry, that energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory, suggestive of a lack of understanding. Hmm. However, that can be overcome with time and education. You rang? Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, can I come? Got a question. Planet runs out of energy. It and everything on it dies, right? <sighs> yes. Is there any way to avoid this? Like, making the spiritual energy stronger? Why are you asking me such things? <clears throat> I'm sorry. I've come to realize that I'm somewhat stuck in the past. We've entered an era in which humanity exerts unprecedented influence over its environs. And as both the planet and society evolve, so too must science. And yet it seems that I cannot. Perhaps I'm much too old of a dog to learn any new tricks. so much for taking such great care of Nanaki for us. Fellow Bugenhagen instructed me to let you take anything you think might prove useful on your journey. Check out the storeroom when you have a chance.
leave anything to fear. It is not our fellow man. Nor any creature, big or small, with whom we share our home. It is that. This village is lame. Did you know none of the materia here is even real? And don't get me started on the planetologists. Bunch of blowhards in love with the sound of their own voice. Ever keeping calamity at bay. If people everywhere result, I plan to devote the rest of my life to studying. Within you all are the planet's thoughts. Tell me. I heard from fellow Bugenhagen. By all means, please come and join the seminar. Follow me if you would. Which would you say is a more worthy pursuit? They are both one and the same. Wouldn't you agree? I ask you this. Who among you has looked inward into the... I've, uh, always been on the bigger side, but I've never been into physical stuff. Painting and poetry are more my thing. My old man, he... He used to say it was a waste, me spending all my time indoors. According to him, a big kid like me was using twice as much spiritual energy as other folks. And I was a burden on the planet. But he was wrong. That extra energy I received from the planet, it was a blessing. And after imbuing it with my compassion and intellect, I'll give it right back. What about you, miss? You must have a story to share. Please. Me? Uh, okay. I, uh, where to begin? I fell into the life stream. I don't have words to describe it, except beautiful, maybe? It was a lot to take in. Feelings of kindness washed over me. Long forgotten memories came flooding back. It was a warm, comforting place. But there was also conflict. A war between the planet and its enemies. And I can't, I mean, we can't let them win. We need the planet, and it needs us. We have to rise up, fight back, defend it from this terrible threat. Thing is, I don't know how to do any of that. And I hoped you might have the answer. <sighs> I, I'm not criticizing planetology or anything, and I'm not trying to scare anybody either. I just... You know... <sighs> Never mind. This is all coming out wrong. Please, do not be discouraged. Should you ever wish to try again, we would be more than happy to listen. What matters is that you keep challenging your beliefs. Stop doing that, and the answers will forever elude you. On that note, I think we should adjourn for the evening. The River of Lights is almost upon us. 
So let us head to the torch. I'll see you at the festival. Never forsake us. Wow, so many tourists. Must be quite the festival. Did I sound as awkward as I felt? Felt for you. Never been that good with words, as you know. We're just two peas in a pod, aren't we? Though their path led them elsewhere. If they ever find their way back home, I hope to be here. To welcome them with open arms, no matter what they have done. Wow, so many tourists. Must be quite the festival. When you die, you return to the planet? That has literally got to be the dumbest thing I have ever heard. Once you die, that's that. Pretty much. Thank you. So if you get that, you get why I live every day like it's my last. That which disrupts the natural order. The other which may attempt to claim and consume the planet. Look at them, gathered around the fire. Just like us that day. Me and Mom and Dad. If only we could do that again. Uh, never mind. Just forget I said anything. Don't give me that bullshit. You start a story, you finish it. Cloud, if I may, allow me to add a new word to your lexicon. Decorum, meaning polite behavior, often used in the negative, like so. You sometimes exhibit a severe lack of decorum. Wow, so many tourists. Must I had the pleasure of talking to a mentor said it was presumptuous of me to think I could save the planet. She decides her own fate, you see. As rain cleanses the skies, so too does she cleanse herself of filth. So what? We sit here and theorize while the planet rinses and repeats? What do you want to do? Not nothing, that's for damn sure. At the same time, though, I don't know if fighting's the answer anymore. Maybe it's time for some good old-fashioned introspection. Wow, 
Wow, so many tourists. Must be quite the festival. So, I'm an ancient, as in a steward of the planet, one of those ancients, or to be more precise, the only ancient. For the most part, it's been a source of pain. I've been held against my will, I've been watched, I've been ignored, even hated. And it's been that way ever since I was little. My blood's been nothing but a curse. If I ever started to forget, something would remind me of what I was and bring me crashing back down to Earth. It was always the same. Time after time. I'd be shown a glimmer of hope, only to have it snatched away. I was never gonna be normal. That much was clear. Okay. <laughs> so my blood's been a curse, but it's also been a blessing. It's brought some wonderful people into my life, friends that I love. And for once, I think I'm okay. Happy even. And all that pain feels worth it. Even if I can't lead a normal life, there is one thing I can do. Return their kindness. And try to make the most of what I've been given. It is time! <sighs> Whoa! <laughs> Pretty sappy, huh?
So, this is where you've been, Nanaki. What's up? There's something of great import I need to show you. And by that, I mean all of you. Join me, would you? What did you all think of the River of Lights? For whatever reason, the ceremony has drawn a number of tourists to the Vale as of late. When I ask for their impressions, they often speak of how beautiful it was. Some claim they were even moved to tears. It's an overwhelmingly positive reception, I'm happy to say. To stir the human soul is no small feat, and it pleases me to know that the River of Lights possesses such power. Alas, my hopes to parlay their emotional response into a deeper intellectual curiosity. They have yet to be fulfilled. People are surrounded by cats, dogs, birds, and trees. They know that life is all around them, be it through the birth of a baby or the blooming of a flower. They bear constant witness to the blessed cycle of creation, yet they've no interest in the welfare of our planet. <laughs> Forgive me for sharing my idle thoughts. Keeping them to myself is quite a challenge in my old age. I'm glad to know that Aerith has friends like you to keep her company. Today's experience was surely the will of the planet. May you cherish it always. Oh, 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 oh. Well then, shall we proceed? Uh, but I thought this door was... Sealed so that none may enter? Why, yes. And by my own hand, no less. However, you've a trial to undertake. I do? If you wish to prove yourself and become a Watcher of the Veil, vale, that is. I presume you are prepared. Yeah. I will also require your assistance in carrying out the trial. Much danger awaits within, and I wish to ensure his safety. When you're ready, simply say the word. Shall we begin? Actually, let me check my equipments and all that stuff. I got no idea what the hell I have. Let me think. Wait, why do I have level boost? Okay. Uh. Or something, Pete. I don't need this. Actually, this should be for Earth, but it's okay. Uh, look. Skill Master.
Oh no, I mean. Definitely want that. Yes, I can do. Oh, Tifa has a higher slot. So, four slots my best? Damn, I need another one. Okay. Shall we begin? And off we go. Now we follow the cave where it leads, deep as it will take us. told you anything about his parents yet? No. Nope. They were watchers, both of them, but they couldn't have been any more different. When our village came under attack, my mother fought with courage, with honor. She faced the enemy and laid down her life to save us. My father, though, he turned tail and ran. He was a coward. So then, you still haven't forgiven him? Why would I? I see. <laughs> From this point onward, only two may proceed. He who shall undertake the trial, and his observer. Who's gonna observe? I'll do it. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> oh, that would render the trial meaningless. But if not him... Ah, you do nicely. What? Me? Him? Really? At least pretend not to hate me. Oh, oh, oh. oh damn it. Whenever you're ready. Ready. Oh, come on. What kind of BS is that? God damn it. Oh, I already have four slot. Everybody has four slaughters. Oh, that sucked. I was hoping for a, uh... Uh, see what... One to 13, I barely have anything. Uh, I guess I can use spirit then. Actually, Bear should be fine by himself. He's tanky.
Do I even have a combo of Barret? There you go. Overfang, okay. This is annoying. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Oh shit! What the hell is this? This AP, huh? It was AP. I don't need that. Uh, prayer and access, I do. Who's this one? I met the yeah, I mean, Barrett has HP up, stead flesh, vitality, auto weapon, provoke, HP up. Nah, pretty much tanky stuff. Okay, that's fine. Um, let's see, skill wise. Lightsaber. And I guess I can give him... Red 13 got haste, sonic boom, where those who have been sealed away are left to mourn their fates. Comfort is only natural. A fierce battle was waged here. And even after 45 years, the scars remain fresh. What? 
You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, somebody fill me in. Who are the Gi? The tribe knows a very few people outside of the Vey. The rest you will learn in due time. Of that you can be certain. For now, let us proceed. Wait, what can this pray? Ah, there was four speakers. This is his kid voice. But yes, he has that old grumpy uh grandpa old man voice.
that a rope? Hmm. Oh, what the hell? Damn if that doesn't look convenient. Oh, I think that's from coming down here. Oh, we can hold on to it. What the fuck? Oh, am I cutting it? Oh, I did. So what's up there? I only got two legs here, you know. How do they respond? You asked for it. Look out! Ah, here it comes. Enjoy. You ready? Sorry. Hope you're ready. Stepping up my game. Let's end this. Don't give up yet. I really like prefer his grandpa voice more. The old man voice. Chamber deception. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. Oh, there's a chest there.
Where'd you run off to? It's like a boss fight here. Definitely a boss fight. That looks like a predator right there. What the hell is that? That is a key. It's huge. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would stress that you uh, mustn't judge a book by its cover. For the key, however, they are as fearsome as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first try. You are to explore this place. Understand the nature of its history. Okay, will do. a key arrow. Its point is coated with a poison that rapidly circulates through the body, slowing the wounded until they are completely turned to stone. Okay, that's actually pretty helpful. Join yourself. Nay, that is not the relic we seek. <laughs> that is but a mere bone. He's still getting items, so why not? <laughs> Oh, 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 
sorry. I haven't slept well of me. Get up there, so... Okay. Wait, healing spell? Seriously? Even in death, their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies, nor make light of their plight. Consider this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver unto us the remnants of our past.
Are these altars? Interesting, because my first thought was, are we going to make it out of this place alive? <laughs> its decor is indeed the opposite of inviting. These look like the statue I picked up. If there is a reason for everything, then one could argue that everything has no reason. Regardless, you know what you must do, don't you? Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Restore them to their rightful place. That is so sus. Seriously. That's like Indiana Jones right there. Oh, what the fuck? Can't go into water here. <laughs> Time to go Indiana, Indiana Jones. Wait, is it responding? These items? Let's 
of the Vale is intertwined with the Gi, for they first came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Naraki. This cave serves as a boundary between our world and that of the key. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the key to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain Watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Since time was of the essence, he entered the cave without reinforcements. As he had feared, it was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. Determined to protect the Vale, he pounced from one foe to the next, felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on, if there was a Watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the Gi. Their malice grows more potent. Get this shit out! Get 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 out!
Oh my god, new weapon for Barrett. The bazooka? Hmm. Let's see how good this one is. This is five slaughter. Oh shit, six slaughter. Nice. Smackdown. Okay. I don't think I'd have anything linked. Uh, or needed to be linked. No, nothing needed. Okay. Well, it's not much good stuff. Oops. Okay, now there's two of them here. No, Bay 4?
this works. Here goes. It's over. Clear me. Got him now. Another. Worth a try. Tear into him. Pretty hard. We should go this way. Oh, uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Up to more enemies. Okay. Here. Oh, there's three of them. So, did he finish learning it? Yes, he did. Perfect. Oh, Sorcerer now. Go and easy. Try 
So I think it's gonna be a little harder on the uh, hard mode because you can't use items. Gotta use magic. Altars. <laughs> there is a similarity, yes. But this sanctum is much more ancient and serves a rather different purpose. The altars we came upon before were built to imprison the key. This, however, was built to provide the Cetra with a means to commune with them. Commune with them? Why would the Cetra do that? The Gi were the enemy. <laughs> Good and evil friend and foe. Dichotomy is not set in stone, as mutable as the winds. But for now, Anarchy, let us concentrate on the matter at hand, clearing a path to the truth.
Watcher fought his way here alone, and in his bravery took upon himself the burden of our hope. It's gonna be his dad. His dad probably sacrificed himself to be here. Oh, uh, yep, boss time. Ah, three prayer materials? Huh. I don't have anything here. It's just up. I was right gonna sit on the bench. Okay. Like a norm normal doggo.
Jesus. Form evanescent, rancor everlasting. 
Well done. You've become quite the formidable fighter. <laughs> sure have. So, does this mean I passed the test? <laughs> oh, oh. I'm afraid that decision is not mine alone to make. <sighs> Let us consult with one more qualified. The Watcher of the Vale fought valiantly, and offered up his life in defense of our home. As you see, he still watches over us to this very day. Wait... is that... Seto? My father? No, there's no way. The poisoned arrows of the Gi transformed his body into stone, and there he has stood ever since, his watch eternal, our savior. What about my mom? Did she know what had happened to him? Oh, oh, oh. why, of course she did. It was, after all, she and Seto who asked me to see her off the cave. But why? Why did she never tell me the truth? Because she knew that if she did, you would attempt to seek your father out all by yourself. Your parents strove to keep our veil safe. But there is one thing they fought even harder to protect. You, Nanaki, their son. She was afraid. Because I was too small and weak. <laughs> Back then, perhaps. But not anymore, heavens no. You've become a fine warrior in your own right. And that is precisely why I brought you here. Like this. It's not where your journey is meant to end, my dear boy. You must leave the Vale once more. But I'm a Watcher now. I gotta protect our home like he did. Listen to me, Mama Ki. When I first heard your friend's emphatic warnings, I dismissed them outright. No more than the ravings of misguided youths. When you've lived as long as I have, start to believe you've seen it all, that no surprises remain. But I realize now how very foolish I have been. The eyes that I thought saw the world clearly have grown blind to new possibilities. But... I would hate to impede your progress any further. I bid you leave, Nanaki, before, like me, you become new to your own ignorance. With sharper eyes and keener ears, go forth and in my stead seek the great truths of our world. Look after him for me. Don't worry. We will. You failed this trial, my boy. Continue your training and try again. Are you up to the task, Nanaki? You bet I am. After all... I am Nanaki, Watcher of Cosmo Canyon. And son of Seto, protector of our veil. Vale.
Hearken unto me. My name is Guy Natak. O oh, brave and noble Seto, I beseech you once more. Hear the urgent pleas of my people. My thanks, Seto. You are as magnanimous as ever. <sighs> the warrior Nanaki. And you, the Setra. Come with me. That was... Oh, an exciting turn of events indeed. We'll back you up for 2,000. Uh No. This one's free. Oh, yes. See. I mean, I gotta... Set everything back again. Oh, God damn it! What the hell? AP? AP. What's my luck at? Oh shit, it's almost maxed. Yes! Um, oh, never mind. It's not even close to maximum. It's two star. What What do I have? Oh god. A tree up Chuck. I think it just did not Elemental material is almost done. No, it's not done. Warding. Where the hell, where's the other elemental? I know I have two elemental. Oh, here it is. What the hell? I guess I gave him this at least. That way I'm half. Elemental resistance. Okay. I don't think, um, So safe here. Uh, 
Can anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? Because some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared of my wits here. I don't know. This gee dude's too nice to freak me out. He may act nice, but who knows what he's planning. Stay alert. A dying wish. The home of the Gi lies beyond. Now let us begin our journey. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's Materia, you can count me out. How strange you should mention Materia. My people are also in search of it. <laughs> <laughs> longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. I promise. Try swaying with the rocking of the boat? I want to move less, not more. <laughs> Didn't seem to mind when you jumped aboard. Well, only because he mentioned materia. Be quiet. The planet is listening. And what's wrong with that? Anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the Cetra. Unfortunately, the Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse me, am I intolerant too? I'm Cetra. <laughs> you are indeed one of them, by lineage alone. You know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Their history? Consider your ignorance a blessing. The Cetra's past is fraught with horror and sorrow. So there I am, on the ground, bleeding out, watching everything go dark. Thinking, this is it. This is how it ends. Only, it isn't. Suddenly, the wind picks up out of nowhere. It tugs at me so hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. Next thing I know, I'm back in the orphanage. But nobody can tell me who found me or how I got there. It's a miracle. Sounds like what happened to me. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. I'm feeling every single force. One minute, I'm outnumbered. 
And the next, I'm alone. None of it makes any sense. I somehow managed to beat the odds and wake up here, alone. Why in the hell did fate pick me? Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> and now that it's just me, what am I supposed to do? You know? Yeah, I get it. Hey, come with me. Sure, but why? I'll explain on the way. So, how's Cloud holding up? Mako Poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. But hey, Hope Springs Eternal. Right. <laughs> if he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and say he's been through There's ten no times that shit. Are anymore. we talking right about there. the same cloud? Come on. The trains are down, the guy's desperate to prove himself. To Not like he needs to. Everyone knows he's a bona fide badass. <sighs> hey, why don't you try picking up some work as a merc? A sack of all trades. Why? Because one's not enough. It's just one thing after another. These think about it. reunions as the station Did you hear? Is this our Is it true? Have all Get a load of this. Okay, let's see. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. We can't let those murderers get away with it. People of Midgar fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then anyone who goes is... An idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks who'll risk it all. Wait! Don't tell me you're going! The things I do for friends. Hey, you ever wondered about your purpose in life? What you're doing here? Sure, from time to time. Or all the time. Would never have guessed. Didn't used to, it's but things changed. Went planet. through a lot after I joined Shinra, like a lot. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to Shinra do with all this time I've been out, given. Right? I mean, they got it. Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah? Cause one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. He didn't tell you? Must not have wanted the competition. When exactly did you meet Cloud? The day before we hit Reactor 1. So... Uh, how long ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. My internal clock's busted. Yeah. Mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> Good question. So, what do you think's gonna happen to our baby? I don't know. Hey, let's get. We got greetings galore. Treat you and yours to something special. You know, but remember, only one isn't person. That just perfect. I think I prefer what being number two or three. Got even Suits me much better. Yeah. Why don't we all go camping? Like, the guy who only has to worry about the how. Doesn't have to decide on the what. A minor role? Exactly. 
I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. And who might that be? Uh, you were the guy with Aerith. Whoever right? brought you back, on, I guess. I'm assuming there was someone. Who could it have been? That's a good question. Hell with it! Let's just do what we want. Start by robbing folks and stop. It's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. Nobody, huh? Not a soul. Well, at least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> hmm? Huh. New recruit? Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche. I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda, that's all. But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> anyway, I'm out, losers. <laughs> I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. <sighs> Sorry for wasting your time. It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's gotta be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. We're not powerless. So long as we don't lose sight of what's important. <sighs> you know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, like your life depends on it. <laughs> the world's lucky to have you. It's a start. Hmm. Anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get a chance. See ya. Think about what I said. Guess I should probably head home too. Home, hmm. oh, huh? Back. Welcome home. Welcome home. Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? Uh. Said he'd visit too. Oh yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? Oh, uh, sorry. Forgot to ask. Aww. Zach, would you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. We're all headed for the same place. You'll see your daddy and Tifa again. Soon? Soon enough, Marlene. Soon enough.
The wind, that was you, wasn't it? Hello in there. of the gear. Oh god, come on, three slaughter? Oh, that sucks. Guess I'll do this later. I don't want to waste... <laughs> I don't want to waste my... thing. for these the 13 is about to weapon level up uh oh, i need one more divine heartwood oh so close and spear Oh my god. Two, four, six. Ooh. Boom. I didn't make this? Really? Oh, I can't even make a bone brisket. Maybe I can buy it. Check. Uh, do I need this time? No, I don't. Gun got pints. Okay.
Nope, can't do that one. Uh, give me like a like a three to three to five minutes. I want to go downstairs, get a drink and a quick snack. Now I'll continue on. So about a three to five minute break, and then continue on. So I'll be right back.
Okay, got me my the restroom. Got me a little snack and drink. are condemned to linger. Outsiders such as we are unwelcome, forever denied the planet's embrace. <sighs> I feel for you. Can only imagine how tough that's been. My kin now dwell within these effigies. I beseech you, lend them your ears. Long has it been since they have had an audience. <laughs> They're not bound to the planet, and so she rejects them. Because you have to come from the life stream to return to it. Which means these dudes can't die, right? <laughs> They're invincible! I'm not sure that's something to celebrate. Being stuck as spirits with no hope of release sounds like a fate worse than death. As if you know anything about dying. Uh, I mean, are you even really alive? <laughs> Another stuck spirit, perhaps? We shall not rest till the materia is ours. You and me both. I can petrify or stun or stop. I can't even. T I don't know what the hell happened right there. <laughs> Materia, you mean? We long 
Materia. So an ultimate Materia? Where is it? You gotta tell me! In the Materia of Peace, we shall find the end for which we have all y'all, but I got a sinking feeling. I think we probably don't want to overstay our welcome here. It's hard to feel at ease around folks whose only desire is death. And if the planet won't let them have it, well, who's to say they won't let the planet have it? Save uh, me! Sure. Don't you think someone responsible like me ought to hang on to that materia? So it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. I think we shouldn't get involved at all, Lassie. Little late for that. <laughs> what do you think he wants us to do for him? Steeped in our one desire. Purest of materia no more, with pain and spite a lack. Steeped in our one desire, purest of materia no more, with pain and spite a lack. Steeped in our one desire, purest of materia no more, with pain and spite a lack. Whatever that materia is, we can't let them have it. No matter how much they want it. Don't know how far we can let this go, but for now we play along.
Those not born of the life stream can never join its flow. One cannot return to that from which one did not arise. And so our souls sought refuge here. Yet idleness brought no solace. Our days, a penance imposed by the planet for the sin of our existence. And now, our only wish is to be freed from this prison, to be granted true release. desire for freedom. After an eternity, the materia began to stir, and thus did we rejoice, knowing that salvation was within our grasp. We rejoiced, so convinced were we that our prayers for release had not been in vain. Yet the loathsome Cetra trespassed upon our lands and stole the treasure that would grant us deliverance. Therefore, we ask that you retrieve it the Black Materia, key to our oblivion. Please, it alone can liberate us from this endless dream. The key cannot rest until our sacred treasure has been restored to us. Moreover, in redressing the crime of her ancestors, the Cetra may help us to let go our ancient grudge. Where is it? It is said the orb lies within a place of Cetra worship. A place of Cetra worship? Or temple? You know what? I have an idea! At least, I think I do. Forgive me, Hollow One, if I regard you with suspicion. Now hold on there! I'm friend to one and all, thanks to my crystal ball. No matter your need, I have the right read. <sighs> He's strange, but you can trust him. Really. Trust you will return our materia to its rightful home. Only you can end our torment. Ah, uh, I guess we're back. Yeah. We need to get moving. Right! I'll make you proud, Dad. Just wait. It 
It's good to see you again. Allow me to escort you to fellow Bugenhagen. Please, this way. <laughs> Hook, line, and sinker. Those undead suckers actually think we're gonna give them back their materia. They called it their salvation or whatever. But to me, it sounded more like something with the potential to wreak some serious havoc. Nope. No way in hell are we letting them have it. Can't let him have it either. Him? Sephiroth. Did no one else sense him? <gasps> no. You're the resident expert. If you say Sephiroth was there, I'll believe you. Wait, wait, wait. So, are you saying Sephiroth's after the Black Materia too? Probably. Better to assume he is. Oh, come on! Let's go, let's go! Can't let anyone get between me and my Materia! So, Kate Sith, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Cetra Temple anyway? Uh, well, like, uh, I wouldn't say I know about it exactly. Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If we can get to a Shinra terminal, I should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? They set any up here? I think so. But I bet old Boogie will know for sure. You might have returned to the planet. Oh, come on. We both know you didn't need to worry about me. After all, I am the son of Seto the Watcher. Forgive me. But if I recall correctly, Shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in Cosmo Canyon. So, where is it? Oh. oh what did become of that thing? Ah, yes. Now I remember. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, uh, I did some tinkering. Some tinkering, I say, though it was quite a lot. But now it serves a decidedly more practical purpose. You've got to be kidding me! Oh, well, do you know about a Cetra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. The Cetra never engaged in such practices. I... didn't know that. Maybe it was referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a sign of importance to the Cetra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Perhaps, though I know not where it is. Huh? And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. <sighs> However, the rewards may yet outweigh the risks. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For then no secret will elude you, however well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bugenhagen! What is it? I'm a little busy here. Another man in a black robe has come. What should we do? Well now, a friend of yours? Where'd you see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah.
We're at the Cosmo Canyon, Cloud. A long-standing dream of mine has finally come true. Planetology rejects our Mako-consuming society, insisting that we have much to learn about this world. And now, we have the opportunity to share in their planetary knowledge. Front. Just stop me now! Ah, 
Time to celebrate. This data is incredible. Thank you for your contribution. I hope you won't mind my mentioning, but I've observed that world intel collection is stalled of late. I'm certain, however, a veteran mercenary like you would never abandon a task. I know you must be busy, but I'd appreciate your help. Nanaki! Is this man okay? He is, albeit rather weak. Not sure why, though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, 
And this isn't it. Nebo. I'm... Nebo. I'm... Nebo. Ain't that... Where Tifa and I grew up. Ah! Oh, of course! Nibelheim has a terminal. I'd bet my whiskers on it. It, uh, had a terminal. Cloud, remember when you told Gein attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm going to prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. It's not that. We should go. Hey! <laughs> Wait, you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right then, back to the airstrip we go. The chance. There's no point in making choices. The torture comes. Finally, let us gaze. Again, Nanaki's companions, yes? Forgive me, I've yet to introduce myself. I am Caesar, one of the canyon's mentors. Now then, to answer your question, rather vile fiends have been sighted in the Vale. Ones believed to be portents of calamitous ruin. Really? The creatures have been observed on many occasions in times long since past. But always has our planet risen to the challenge, brought her might to bear and staved off disaster. 
It is through this unique celestial event that the planet provides us with proof of her victory. As you can see from these photographs, once the cataclysm has been averted and our world stands triumphant, gloriously resplendent comets grace the heavens. Huh. I don't see anything like that around here. Indeed. Though it should be said that none of these pictures were taken close by, but rather far from our current location. Perhaps we simply cannot see the miracles from here. The falling stars may have left their marks in the skies elsewhere. We're gonna go look for them, right? As if you'd ever take no for an answer. Truly? You would do this for us? It would be a great weight off our shoulders were you to find them. If you are serious, I suggest visiting the three locations in which the fiends were last seen. The signs we seek may show themselves there. Here, use these reference materials and this recording instrument. Photograph the comments you spot, though try to ensure your pictures match ours. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Hello, Plat- Nah. I kind of took a break to play a uh, unicorn, so. And then I did Stutter Blade about yesterday or day before, and now I'm back to this. <laughs> a seminar is in progress. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Hope is. for field work. I haven't performed any in quite some time. At the moment, I'm trying to hunt down my tools. I must have buried them awfully well. But where? Field work? And storage? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you ought to let us handle it. <laughs> oh, treating me like I'm some invalid? I am the very picture of health. <laughs> See what I mean? Just swallow your pride and let us take care of whatever it is. You stay and rest. <sighs> well, I suppose I should pick you up at the offer while you're still here. Very well. I'll let you assist me. Good. Now, lay it on us. <laughs> In truth, something has been troubling me as of late. Take a look at this field report from my previous survey of the life springs in our local region. Are you sure this is accurate? It was at one point, but life springs are mutable. They rarely remain in one location for long. Indeed, such events move periodically. Nothing unusual about that in the least. However, it is not their positions which trouble me. Rather, what the survey team has reported. Perhaps this fact-finding expedition of ours will clear things up. I would have you visit this site first. Then, measure the Marco frequency using this meter of mine. All right, we'll do. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance?
speculations about making Bahamut arisen any stronger. I cannot decide if this development is positive or terrifying. I'm hyped for Stellar Blade though. I don't think I fly all the way across. I oh, know there's more. Right I want to go here. Uh, oh, it's over where that platform is. I need to... I have no idea. Uh, there's something, definitely something over there. Wait, is that the spring? I can't tell. Okay, from here, can I go all the way across? Okay, there's two of them. 
Which one did I go on? Oh, I went to that one. Oh. Make damage that uh, amulet. Oh, yes. See what's over there. I teleport back here eventually. Yeah, I can. Thank, thank God. Uh, how do I get to that one? I get that and I turn right. I jump. Right, I guess. Oh, actually, I should have been down there, huh? Yeah, it is. Oh. So, I get on that balloon and turn right. Holy shit. I clipped through it. Thank <laughs> you. 
that what I think it is? It's like Dutty on here. It's, it's way over here. It's, it's not even sure what the hell that is. that map. <laughs> I can't even tell. I oh, guess this is something probably later on. Luckily I have a uh, teleporter. from POV here. I don't know if it's above me or under me. Oh, yeah, I remember. I think I made a comment about this place. No, not here. We're close, though. right here. I think I can go from here to go out more. I can go around. Ah, oh, I can go around. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. It's not. <laughs> Oh, it's down there. Oh, it's down there. Holy shit. I gotta go down.
Uh, I would say. Need to go easy. Oh shit. Oh fucking A. Fire to the just one of the above. Boom shield section. Fire.
excellent work out there, Cloud. Thanks to you, we've obtained invaluable intel. The study of such ancient creatures will surely provide insight into the region's history. <sighs> All you ever care about is your intel. It wouldn't kill you to show a little concern for Cloud's well-being, you know? You aren't hurt, are you, Cloud? <laughs> you worry too much, Mai. Rest assured that I always keep a close eye on him. I can tell at a glance if he has suffered any injuries. In fact, Cloud, I guarantee that I know more about your physical condition than you do. That's a considerably rare material, Cloud. I suspect it will prove useful in crafting new creations. I suggest you hold on to it. Hey, party level? Oh, sir? Damn, 10 more. Uh, I don't think I can make anything with that, huh? Yeah, nothing yet. But I can make it. I only can make one, though. Who okay, can equip it? Um. Let's see. So Yuffie has the most, so Klaus should have the next one. Since he's locked. Oh, I have this one too. Actually, I'll keep this to Cloud, cause... Yes, Spirit Bound. I guess I'll give Air of Spirit Bound. What does Tifa have? Okay, Tifa has a 5 slot. Uh, 5 slot for you? One, two, three, four. So five, four. Okay. Oh, not that it matters. Lightning, wind lightning. Ooh, petrify. That would be helpful. I wonder if, um, Skill Master. I should try this on Yuffie. I really should try this on Yuffie. Try AP up this. That's right. Uh, elemental AP up. Um. What 
What does she have right now? Beat up, luck up, strength up, HP stagger, or strike, enemy skill, HP. Magnifying time, prayer X. Let's. Let's see why I switch uh, strength with that other one. Skill materia. Skill master. Fight it one more time. That was a fun fight. It's wrong one. Ah, oh, god damn it. I missed time to dodge. Wait, where's the, where's the goddamn hills my Asuna? Oh my god, don't tell me I had equipped it. No way in hell. Here we go. Keep up. Go on. Just no. 
Oh, fucking A. Again, seriously? Oh, that's fine. I got it. There's so much explosion, it's kinda hard to see when you can when you should dodge. <laughs> It's easier on smaller enemies to see when you can when you should dodge. Anything here? Should go higher? Ah, oh, fuck. Uh oh, ill omen, twelve o'clock. Oh, well, what the f what? Save and kill. Mr. Dodge, that face. Oh, goddamn bird! Holy shit, that bird! Goddamn that bird! That bird fucked me up. Wait, 
is the backline command. When the current party is in dire so you can call upon your other comrades to execute some demons. Oh, okay, nice to know now. Don't care though. England, really. I should have killed a penguin first. I really should have. I really should have killed the uh, stupid ass penguin. <laughs> penguin got clouded and you be killed. Wait a minute, I'm missing some. Uh, missing the that thing. Does it matter? Oh, so don't tell me it's no, okay. Let me see. Uh, nice. This is perfect. Well, well. Okay. Maybe you ought to add photographer to your resume. <laughs> Let's look for other spots. That's some bubble. It's gone. Next one. What's this? Oh. Next one's. Oh, that's my guy dived down. There's some more notes. Look at Aerif. You missed the extra stuff bonus for the cycle. What extra stuff bonus? What? There's an extra stuff bonus? Oh, that sucks. Oh, seriously? Oh, man. Oh. Oh, that sucks. Uh. Yeah, I have, uh, hopefully I have two other chances. Yeah. Uh. Did it trigger? Oh. Well, actually, wait a minute, can I reload? Actually, I don't even know how far back am I. Oh, I, I did this before. Yeah, wait. Uh, I think I say before the uh, fight. Wait a minute, seventy five thirty two. Ah, oh, let's see what happens. Oh, that's right, right here. Hey, what? Here we go. Kill the penguin first this time, goddammit. Kill the penguin first. Uh. Oh, 
This hunt penguin didn't kill me. Oh, the picture. Right. I guess I stay back more, huh? I was like 80% last time. Oh, I, because it was zero. It said zero, so I was like, what the fuck? Oh man, I didn't know how I got. Uh. Let's go brighter face. Okay, that didn't do shit. It's to have to have this in the picture, though. In front? What do you mean, like in front of her, like this? No, no, it can't be. You need the stars. It, it didn't count. I'm still stuck here. It didn't count. Oh, it's just an extra. So, so you need to take a picture of her alone and then take. Oh, I thought you had to do both together. That's what I thought you mean. Okay, so you confused me. I thought you mean uh, having both them together. After, why can I get that eighty percent? I want to have her in the part picture too. God. Oh, come on. It's just a little tap. I saw that green. There you go. 
No, at least I've written pictures here. Nice. This is perfect. Well, well. Maybe you ought to add photographer to your resume. <laughs> Let's look for other spots. Okay. What extra? What is the extra? From here, or yeah, jump from. Here. Let me see if I start from. Else right here. Okay. This is another penguin. Oh god damn it. Oh there's two penguins this time. Oh man. Wait, do I have that material? Skill books. Eh, I don't know. I have no idea if that's working or not. That's fine. That's why. Oh, I hope this is not getting me killed. I assume I'm gonna do the same thing again. <laughs> Take another picture of her. Have a better
It feels like it's too sensitive. Holy shit. I think it's too sensitive. I need to change it, get a better angle. Seventy eight point one. Seventy eight point eight. What the fuck? Seventy eight point nine. Oh god damn it, I see it. Ugh. This is spot on, Cloud. Okay, two down. Just one more left. Let's go. Uh What? I've never been to this part? What? How? Oh, yeah, that's awkward. I uh, hope it's going to go from here. down there I think oh soar hunter thank you for the resub really appreciate it Okay, I'm definitely not going to the right direction. Let's just stuff. Huh. <laughs> Happy. Thank you. Happy thanks you too. All Twitch money goes to Happy. Just saying. Okay, just... We'll go down just... Okay. We go let me go down wait how's it going higher oh shit wrong direction Fuck. wait can't go this way though Oh, 
Oh, can I? Nope. Okay. I have no idea. If I go here, I don't think that help. Do I backtrack around? Don't tell me I could backtrack backward. That'll be dumb if you can. Oh my god, you can't backtrack. I think. Or maybe you can go down like that and around. It's definitely here, up there. Oh, I see a pathway. I don't think I've ever been up here. <laughs> Holy crap. Or how, or maybe I did. Is there any penguins? I don't think I see any penguins. Man, god damn, um... Is it in the week to ice? It is, what the hell? Okay, perfect. Okay. That is so weird. I didn't get a single pressure. What? <laughs> Whoa. I know you snuck a shot of me earlier. 
Nothing sneaky about it. Is that so? <laughs> hey, let's get a selfie together, okay? Come here. <laughs> oh, perfect. Aerith. Let's take the photo and go. Sure. Sounds good. So I assumed that was the extra scene. Good. Uh, quick. Back war. Get these back to Caesar, huh? Okay. That's next chapter, I assume. Here. How do I get here? Assume from this chest. Go like that. Or am I? Yeah, I mean. How do you take a picture? this Cosmo Canyon board I don't recall that okay this one is a that one I'm not too sure where And this is annoying because the whole goddamn map looks the same to me. <laughs> Let me turn in the others. Uh, here. Track quest. I can teleport here? Oh, come on. Why can't I teleport to town?
don't know. It's like a lending for our ears, but remember. Wow, I can already feel they say that the every life is born of the planet. Feel the energy all around you. We're now embarked on a tour of the planet. We yearn to chase the planets. I could have teleported. Ah, the falling stars have indeed revealed themselves to us. Mm -hmm. All three of your photographs are precisely what I require. Yes, these will make a marvelous reference for posterity. As always, our planet is as strong as she is beautiful. No matter the calamity, we have no reason whatsoever to fear for her demise. Interesting. It appears that there are more comets than were previously observed. Perhaps this is a sign that our planet has, in fact, grown more robust. Yes, surely it is. And if we take note of their positioning, and connect each with lines. Just so. I see it. The pattern. An unprecedented configuration. Hey, what did you wish for? Hmm? Well, only what anyone else would. I just asked the stars to protect us from harm. Right. Of course. That face you made earlier, what was that about? Don't know what you mean. Guess the shooting stars have said their piece. Yep, my first status. Okay. Ah, damn. Uh, there's a three turning dinghy. So two turning. Oh, so so should be around. Oh fuck. It'll be around this area here, allegedly. No, there's a bridge above that three turning. Thing. I don't think there was a bridge there. Holy Lord. It can't be this place. No way in hell. It's not even close to the just a tower supposed to be next to me. Ooh. Would you stand s <laughs> still, damn it, clown? Why are you shaking like you got? Oh my god! It has to be here. It has to be here.
What the fuck am I supposed to do? Ask me. I wish I got the request. Head to the first live spring and take new measurement to compare to those of previous. No, I can't figure out the landmarks. I'm goddamn blind. Oh, some. It's a bridge. Unless there's another one right here, I did not see. Oh my god, don't tell me it's right here. Shit, I think there's one right here. It's completely blocked up. <laughs> oh god. No, I don't want to go there. Let's go from here, go north. Uh. I think there's this part's not unexplored, so I'm sure there's a three propeller thingy. Because the bridge is I see the bridge right here, so it should be a propeller thingy here, I maybe. I don't know. Yeah, there is one. Holy sh what the fuck is that sound? Have this unlocked? Or at least found. So it has to be. Don't tell me. Hope it's up. Okay. Paragon, that makes it a lot easier to see. So. So it has to be here? Yeah, it's good trouble it takes some running out of patience. My patience running thin. Oh, that's f that damn. Wait, there's a gate. How are we supposed to get past it? Or is there another entrance? Oh, 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 oh. Ah, forgive me. You'll need a key. I got. I should slap you. Here, you're supposed to be at home. Well, there's no need to make such a fuss. I simply wish to see this with my own eyes. Oh my God, there was a key. Give me goddamn floating warp things so I can fly around. Oh god. Uh, yeah, this looks kind of familiar. It's just like the. Unfortunately, it looks the same to me. Should be right here. This part of the building should be around here. Let's start from here. Uh, right here?
Oh god, I'm stuck. Excuse me, how did I get out of this? God. I forgot how I got out of this. It's a meter ago. I think it's the right spot. I'm shaking! Oh my god! Where are the GPS? <laughs> This area. There's two towers next to each other, unless there's another one that's close to each other. Let's see the other. It should be a rune with some goddamn gate there. Damn, so freaking bright. Fucking penguins. Let's take on a big for mercy. Oh, yeah. What you get for coming at the end? We're done here. Don't 
to it. Come on. I'm worried about the other springs. I'm sure it's scripted. I'm sure this shit is scripted. So it's right here somewhere. This is a north one. The south one has to be around here. Yeah, there's a pathway. This should be like right here. That's where I was. What the f? f? I don't see no goddamn. Oh, that doesn't help. No! I see you're approaching the signal. The source appears to be somewhere in the canyon's ruins. That's what we send there. Oh, fucking game. Oh my god, god damn it, Chocobo. Oh no, where did all these monsters come from? Hurry, we gotta protect the spring. Take that! You're gonna reach it! That was excellent work! Doesn't look good. Ten? No. Four hundred? <clears throat> the meter's going crazy. What's a GZ anyway? How do you even read this? GZ stands for Geisel, his first name. Bugenhagen was the first person to discover that the life stream emits energy we can measure. <laughs> But that's not worth mention. More importantly, our work remains unfinished. We'd best get on with it while we still have the light. This is the site to which I would have you attend next. Good luck to you all, and safe travels.
it was the planet's music.
Oh, we have been graced by curious guests. Hey, I was wondering, do you believe in fate? That something out there controls our future? Oh, ho, ho. fate is a salve we use to soothe the sting of disappointment. We are the masters of our lives, Nanaki. Would you not agree, Cloud? Yeah, sure. My, my, over 7,000. Hmm. This is an unprecedented level of activity. Doubtless proof that the flow of the life stream has shifted in some manner or another. The question is, was this shift natural, or was it the product of an external force? A question for another time. One location remains. Monsters this time. Hmm. It appears that this site has gone fallow. I sense a fight. Sus. Cloud. The Marco meter, if you would. We'll handle these guys. <laughs> 
I am getting too old for this. <sighs> My point exactly. I learned far more than I anticipated today. Though I harbored doubts, I now concede that you were right. Something is happening to the planet. Many questions remain, but I can share with you some answers. Life springs are founts of Marco whose locations are dictated by the life stream's ever-changing flow. Yet in all my years, never have I seen a once thriving spring wither in so short a time. While still just a theory, given all I have witnessed, I believe the planet is changing on an unprecedented scale. A malevolent energy descended upon that life spring. Never in all my years of planetological research have I ever seen such a disturbing phenomenon. You, however, appeared unfazed by what you witnessed. Yeah. <laughs> you needn't explain, Nanaki. Indeed, it may be best that you do not. The experiences of others may skew our own perception of the truth. For the time being, Quiet observation is key to unraveling this mystery. In the grand scheme of both the planet and the life stream, the lives of us mortals and the sublunary parts we play are undeniably inconsequential. For our world is the accumulation of trillions of souls, an assemblage of all life that ever was and will ever be. But that is far too reductive a way to view the cycle which sustains us. We are, after all, a part of the planet. And the planet is a part of us, too. We mustn't forget that even the smallest of ripples can gather the strength to become the greatest of waves. It is thus incumbent upon us to do all we can in the time we are allotted. Do not die a ripple. I endeavor to do just that. I will continue to work to uncover the planet's secrets. And if I find anything, I will let you know. All right, just try not to overdo it. For me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, now who could this be? Why, it's from a watchman in town. How odd. Oh, what did you say? Is something wrong? I fear there is. The survey team has returned with reports of sightings of key spirits within the veil. But they were sealed within the cave. Indeed they were. I can attest to that. So how did they get out? Well, these are spirits, Nanaki. Who knows what they can or cannot do? Though I know this is sudden, will you lend us your raid? <laughs> Go and speak to the Watchman at the gate. I will return to the Vale on my own. Yes. 
see that bro? Step the planet. Folks, we want to get a talisman in the mm -hmm. Cosmos above, Grinch. Pleasant dreams, I trust. Think they pulled it off? I mean, you were their star king before they This place is divine! So this is the famous... Have yielded, and if perhaps you would like to use it to develop materia.
again? These birds? Okay. This calls for more Yuffie! Are my trials not challenging enough? I hope you won't mind my... I think I already have first strike. Wouldn't mind leveling up though. Almost there. What level is this one? Oh, it's only one. But he doesn't provoke, oh, that's what. Mentioning, but I've observed that world intel. Where the hell's that? Where's that dude? Oh, so installed of late. I'm certain, however, a veteran mercenary like you would never abandon a task. I know you must be busy, but I'd Nah. I'll worry about that later. I have too many materials to level up first. And I don't want to refix everything again. He actually has two of them. One of them has zero slot. The other one has like very little. We just got word thing. from the survey team that they spotted the gi right outside of town. Yeah, I heard. Are they okay? They weren't attacked, were they? Don't worry. Everybody's fine. Happened to be near the elevator, so they were able to escape in time. 
Though they had to leave their truck behind, unfortunately. Okay, I'll go take a look. We can't let more into the veil. Appreciate it. Just uh, be careful out there. Up there, uh, up in the tower, it is. Let's start from here. There should be on the ground level. Just penguins. There's goddamn penguins. Wait. Oh god, possessed penguins. Oh, three of them this time. Whoopee. Oh, four. Holy shit. To run to. Let's 
super chocobo speed. What the hell? They can find control this time. Lightning pressure not to use during that pretty cast shield or it will reflect. Okay. Oh, there's a Kujan. Okay, man. Seto, I'm his son, Nanaki. There's a lot of things I don't know yet, but I want to learn. Can you teach me about my father? About you? Your father? I see. As you wish, son of Seto. What would you like to know? Seto ventured deep into the caverns below your home that day. Alone, that he might persuade us to cease our ingress. Though we had braced ourselves for battle, we found ourselves captivated by his resplendent mane. He was a beautiful creature, in both body and soul. So swayed were we by his courage and sincerity, that we chose to entrust with him our singular desire. We desire the return of our Black Materia, and deliverance from this purgatory. 
We believed Seto to be a man of his word, yet his betrayal proved otherwise. Our hopes placed in him, only to be trampled upon. We were forsaken, overcome with rage. One by one, our arrows found their mark, yet Seto was unfazed by our assault. As a confidant, our secrets he would keep. As a penitent, our vengeance he would accept. Yet Seto would not forsake his duty to keep us from the Vale. He was resolute, his will adamantine. And with every arrow that struck, his body hardened to match his resolve before our very eyes, unmoving in the face of our relentless onslaught. It was not long until we lost heart, conceding the futility of our plight, and sank back into the dark depths whence we came. Yet the darkness granted us no comfort, and certainly not the oblivion for which we so desperately yearn. I... I know this might sound hard to believe, but I want to finish what my father started. I want to fulfill his promise to you. Is that so? And even if you don't trust me, Dina Talk does. He asked me to get back your materia. Like I told him, I'll do everything I can to make sure you can rest in peace. All I ask is that you wait in your cave until I return. And if we comply, you will keep your word. It might take some time, but I'll do it. Very well. At long last. And thus, the promise has been made. See that it is not broken, son of Seto. You sure about this? They're gonna hold you to it. And I hope they do. Dad understood the Gi's suffering, but he also understood others would suffer if the Gi ever got the materia back. He was willing to bear that pain for them, even if it turned him to stone if it meant that he could spare others from their wrath. We just have to find that black materia, and we have to make sure that no one gets their hands on it, not the Gi or anyone else. But I do want to keep my promise. I'm going to find a way to release them from their suffering. There's got to be an answer out there somewhere, and I'm not going to stop searching until I find it. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Spoken like a true watcher. You heard all that? Our hopes and our dreams give us strength. Remember that. Hold tight to yours, and see that you never let them go. In time, they shall lead you to the answer you seek. The survey team can now resume their expedition. I don't even remember what the hell this gave me. <laughs> what happened to the uh, new items or something? What? Oh, I think it's this one. 
just summon a call forth from battle. What the hell is Yuffie you see? Oh, speed. Yeah. Bob's safety bit? Uh, I guess that makes sense. These can't be changed. I don't think she needs to. Probably something like this. The six MP more doesn't seem. Yes, yeah, so let's here it goes. Circle it. Okay. If he's in any difference, six eight. Six eighteen. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. So everything's done now, I assume. Have you heard? Yep. Okay. To think. Okay, I'm gonna stop here for tonight. Uh, it's been a while since I played it, so I had I was trying to get back into form. Uh, tomorrow I have to work. It'll be not here. Before I go on to I assume it's gonna be the next chapter after this. I'm gonna get these phenomenon. I got four proto relic, four of them. I wonder what kind of ridiculous mini game is gonna be this time, if any. Do these four and then continue continue on to the next uh, continent. In chapter. Aside from that, that's pretty much it. Yeah, I'll be playing this until... Uh, who knows? Next major game will be Stellar Blade. April 26th. So still got... 26 days left before... A new game. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a good night. Thank you to Sword Hunter for the follow. I'm a resub. Re really appreciate it. All proceeds will be going to Happy for her treats and um, food. Just to let you know. Hey, thanks for watching. Have a good night. Stay safe and be happy. Peace. See you all um, tomorrow. Hopefully after work. Have a good night. Thank you for watching LL stream. If you enjoy the stream, please follow and subscribe to Happy.